Welcome my YouTube channel please subscribe now our eyes were as wide as ill is while watching the May 14th episode of The Young and the Restless. As Jill explained why she had given all her power at Chancellor Winters to Billy, all we could think was how Ani Mommy, for fear that Devin was going to push her son out of the company, had taken steps to ensure that that would be impossible. In essence, Shed said, I know nobody likes my kid or wants to work with him, so I'm going to make you keep him around, anyway. What are we even supposed to think now? Billy has always been a Nepo baby, but this twist takes his silver spoon-fed privilege to a whole new level. He may not have seen the promotion coming, but he's for sure not gonna let it go. And let's see. In every cush job he's ever had, he's been an agent of chaos. How many of those gigs has he gotten in the first place? That weren't because he's an abbot. And what skill does he bring to the table except for a preternatural aptitude for smugness asked Billy at one point fun. Likeable? At this point, he is being written in such a way that his mantra might as well be I exist, and therefore, I deserve. It's not a good look for him or anyone. And, as with so many things these days on the young and the restless, it does have to be that way Jason Thompson can charm the paint off a wall. So why is his character being, in essence, assassinated? Instead of allowing Billy to be the life of the party, whether or not a part. 